So, Lumsden Motel, we're about to leave it. Um, been a very successful six days fishing. Um, Absolutely. What are, your, what are your lasting thoughts? My lasting thoughts, obviously, sad to leave. Yes, me too. I had a, such a great time. I, I could just keep on fishing for a long, long, long time because yep. it's such great fishing down here. It is. The week's been fantastic, beyond expectations in terms of palling up with Rob here. Um, Lord Gadget. Absolutely. Subscribe. <laughs> Lord, Lord Gadget. Sub the button below and subscribe. <laughs> Um, and just lots, lots to learn, yeah. lots to do when we get home in terms of, for me personally, casting practice, but overall, can't wait to get back here. Uh, so casting practice and, and maybe handling a longer leader. I, yes, I, I, I yes, want to work on those, yes. those yep. two no, things. Good point, good point, um, good point. And maybe a bit more confidence fishing dry. So I, I mean, I, we've had such good luck on dry. Yeah. It's been, yeah. been great. Yeah. I agree. Um, I agree. And also, I guess next time I come, I'd like to have a bit of um, a chance to do some Euro nymphing as well, because I think there's some fantastic fish that we probably walk past. Whole new world yep. to explore there. Yeah, good. Absolutely. Well, it's been great yes. fishing with you. Thank you so much. No, pleasure. And we'll pleasure, keep in Rob. touch. It's been brilliant. Thank good. you so much. Bye. So, this whole event has been uh, organized and managed by Chris, um, our host. And uh, what, are your, what are your overall reflections on, on our group and, and how we've gone this week and the quality, of the, more specifically, the quality of the fishermen? Oh, oh incredible group. Fantastic. It was, we have gelled it was, well. It was amazing. Not yeah. a bad, no, I wouldn't say a, a bad word said amongst any of us. No, um, no. Which, which has been great because yeah. it's, it's six random people put together. Yeah, yeah, who've never met each other. Who've well, never met each other. Yeah. Just that, yeah. it, you know, brought together by the common and common love of, of trout fishing and yeah. and and New Zealand and yeah. everything that that offers. Fantastic, fantastic! I've freak. loved it. Thank you so much eh, no, for everything pleasure. you've done. It's been really, really great. Um, uh, it's actually wildly exceeded my expectations. Um, you know, I've, I've sort of caught the same number of trout in a week that I would catch <laughs> in a in a in a maybe in a day in Australia but and the size but I've had PB 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 yeah. PB yeah. PB <laughs> yeah. it just keeps going up and up just keeps got, going up yeah, and up yeah yeah yeah, yeah. yeah. Fantastic. yeah. so it's great thank you my pleasure any uh, any parting comments for the uh, for the Lord Gadget um, subscribers uh, if you come to New Zealand remember to make the first cast count oh, shit yeah yeah good advice yeah First cast count. It's it's um, Mark and I yesterday were, were actually having a chat about how th this is high stakes poker. Absolutely. Ba back in in Australia, at times we at, at times we're not playing high stakes poker. You're, you're hoping, but yeah. here every cast is high stakes poker. Yeah. Um, and you, you're right. You're going to make your first one count. Um, your first cast count. Good. Absolutely. Thank you. See ya. So Nate, so this is it. The this is the the end. I know you guys are going to Queenstown, but um, for a couple more days. But I think this is the end of the fishing fishing segment. Absolutely, mate. It's been a, it's been a blast. Six days of uh, of good good energy and uh, some beautiful rivers and um and waters. First time in New Zealand, so yeah, loved it, mate. It's been awesome. So there has been good energy in the group. That's a good word to use, actually. That that's right. I think we've all pretty well got on together. Not a not an angry word said amongst the six of us, which is a relief. No, no, plenty of good banter though, and uh, and, and holding everyone to account. So that's been that's good. That's true, because it is a pressure cooker. Hundred percent, mate. Yeah, especially um, you know, those days where you got long days on the river, lots of hiking, and you know, it gets late in the day, and um, and you skunked out. So everyone's keen to uh, keen to get some runs on the board. That's true. That's true. So uh, any any advice for a for a, a first timer coming to to New Zealand? I know this is your first trip. It's also my first trip fishing here. Um, any any advice? Yeah, look, it's a good question, mate. I think um, for me, the you know the, the challenge has really been um, you know, ironing out some of the technical bugs in your um, in your skill set. So um, certainly some you know, some things that I picked up that I wasn't doing correctly and probably got away with on rivers in Australia with slightly smaller fish um, came to the surface. So yes. that that's been um, yeah been good. Yeah, um, the I think the technically getting your casting right, uh, yes. particularly in the windy conditions. Yes. Yeah, you know, again, if you um, if you're not sort of used to those conditions, I did find that quite challenging. But um, 
yeah, but with a little bit of practice and, and a bit of perseverance, managed to get there. So yeah, they're probably the two things I think. Um, yeah, I agree. Definitely, ca- you know, casting practice and um, and in challenging conditions because you are going to encounter wind. I, I I agree. So so, I mean, you're worried about the longer leader to start off with. Yeah. And then you're worried about your cast. You got like two quite quite big things there, and then the te- te- technical aspects of actually fighting the bigger fish. I mean, there's a lot. There's a lot going on. Hundred percent. Yeah. Exactly. Um. The the and once you uh, once you get the hook up, you get the strike. Um. You know, they, these are big. You know, bigger fish than I've ever caught. Certainly in Australia. You know, I didn't get any any donkeys, but you know, five five and a half pound fish. Um. Yeah. It's completely different to what I've been used to. So, yeah. Again, there's uh, there's plenty of little tips and tricks. Learn a lot. The guides have been amazing. So uh-huh. um. Yeah. It's been great to, yeah, to, to hone those skills with uh, with some of the best in the business. Yeah. Well, thank you for that. Cheers, Great. Rob. Good pleasure, one. mate. Speak to you soon. I'll, I'll uh, keep in contact in Australia, and um, hopefully you and Lucas and I can go fishing again. Absolutely. Really nice, eh? Sounds good. Good. See ya. Cheers, Rob. This is Lucas. He's been the gun fisherman on our uh, <laughs> on this this trip, but but I mean, even you've been challenged at times. Yeah. yeah. It's been a fun, tricky little um, kind of week and a bit. Um, what I guess the guys have been saying that it hasn't been as fishing as good as normal that's right um but yeah no it's been it's been fun like, still av- our average size of fish was still size, very good hey? i'd say it was like four and a half that's like, right yeah yeah which is good which is good. and i'd say yeah spread out over the week and a bit probably averaging three fish a day each yes which is good or yeah four, maybe four. yeah yeah, yeah. I, I actually i was talking to chris earlier i said i mean at times what i've caught this week i've caught yeah. it in a, in a day in australia yeah but 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 every fish here has has counted. Yeah, it's really exactly, really counted. Exactly. And the day flies on the river. You don't even realize before it's gone. So, That's right. Yeah. So so um, a, a, like a helpful hint for anybody who's maybe thinking about coming to New Zealand for the first time, as Nate and I did this trip. Just lots of practice. Well, that's what Nate said. Yeah. So yeah. I need yeah. a different one. Well, no, 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 no. It's good that that that. Yeah. That, just that lots the of first practice. timer and someone who's yeah. a much more experienced fisherman says yeah. that practice. With the casting, you, like yeah. if you know, Chris said to me earlier, first cast counts. First cast counts, yeah, yeah. Practice longer leader, just lots longer of, leader, lots 100%. of lots down at the park. That's all I do. Okay, yeah, absolutely. Okay. With a with a longer leader and leader. some fluff on the end, and really yeah. when, we, when we're saying longer leader, it's twelve feet plus. Yeah, yeah, fifteen feet. Yeah. And then maybe maybe at home practicing with four X tippet, you just fish four X. Don't you know? Don't don't go and exactly. horse around with three yeah. X yeah, yeah, as yeah. you can get away with in Australia. Yeah. Yeah. Get used to fishing four X. Four X, yeah, it's great. I've really, really enjoyed fishing no, no, it's been with fun. you and getting to know you. Yeah. The banter's been been <laughs> superb, um, and I certainly yeah. hope that you and Nathan and I can keep yeah, in touch in definitely. Australia. That's great. Thank you. Thank you. This is the room that Michael and I shared, the Lumsden Motel. Very comfortable lounge. Little kitchen area with a microwave, a kettle. So there's a bathroom through here. So there's a uh, shower there on the right. Toilet facilities here. There we go. There's the shower, that all worked fine. And then here's my room, relatively tidy. And here's Michael's room with the double bed. Looks like a bombshell's hit it. This is this is Bernie. He's been the the life and soul of the party. Bernard, life and soul of the party. Yeah, um, I'm, I'm, ha- I'm happy to cop that. Fair enough. Fair fair fair, fair commentary. So, how how how's the whole um, the whole experience gone for you? Uh, memorable. I think is probably the best word. Yes. Um, great team of blokes. Um, not often you can get. Uh, well, there was five separate groups one of two and and four of one and uh, all got on so well yeah, uh yeah. you know no disagreements or no. arguments or anything which is you know i i don't think a, a bad word said no. amongst the six no, of us no, um no. at all and the pub's been uh, great every night fantastic uh, colorful yeah. colorful language yes absolutely but you need a little bit of that just to add a little bit of spice you do you do some some um some some pretty funny jokes have been yes, told. Yes, always. Yeah, and I think uh, Nate's going to win the uh, award for the, the big ginge. He's going to win the award for 
the funniest man with the best laugh. That's true. I don't That's think anyone would disagree with that. Many, many of these jokes can, can never be repeated. No, no, uh, no, 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 no. It's only for fly fishermen's ears. <laughs> That's um, true. And, and well away from uh, the general public, I think. It's probably exactly. the best way to describe and that. Definitely away from family and loved ones. So, um, how many trips have you made to New Zealand? Uh, this is my fourth trip. Great. And uh, three down in this area. And okay. uh, yeah, uh, having the red letter day yesterday, I think uh, absolutely Seven made Seven fish for you. Yeah, and I'm I, so and, proud and, and had, two, had two strikeouts. So uh, yes. uh, fishing the. You know, memorable yes. and to knock one on the head over five yes. pound. I think that's something that I will take away from this trip. By the way, I'll, 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 I'll comment out, I'll beep out the name of the river. Cause, <laughs> cause whenever every, anyone asks me, we, we just say we're fishing a river in Southland. That's right. That's right. Yes. But, I, yes. I, but anyone who comes to Southland knows that river. It's, that's true. It's world that's famous. true. You, 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 you fished a memorable, a memorable yeah. river. I, and I'm to, still going to for me. I okay. think I've caught my most fish and my yes, best yes, fish yes, in yes, that yes. river. So Very exciting. And um, Advice for, for new punters? Uh, don't bring as much gear as you think you're going to need because you recycle a lot. Um, uh, drink spates, gold medal. The locals <laughs> don't like it, but it's uh, just remember the pan had 6.9. Um, uh, weather, it's a bit of a gamble. You can't yes. sort of punt on any time of the year. Yes. So it's really just uh, advice on uh, on what your guides and what your uh, hosts and that you know recommend. I think Scotty's done a good time, picked a good time of year. Yes. Although last week they they didn't really have the they luck we did. Um, but we've had a, a magical week apart from one day. And I yes. think if you can fish you know well in five out of your six days, I think that's uh, you, we've got to be pretty happy with that. Yeah, yeah. I, I, actually, I love that comment there about the guides and trusting the guides. Yep. They they know how to find you water. That, that matches the conditions that you're trying to fish Co and you've got to trust them and, and, to do and, that. And, and your ability and me still being a bit of a novice. Um, uh, Bunny Burgess yesterday, he was... Uh, call out to him. Oh, mate, big call out to him. <laughs> he, he, he just, you know, the, 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 the suggestion of... Today, you know, some people would have gone, oh, you know, it's been hammered and that, but he found us some beautiful water with, you know, pools that uh, Jason, my offsider, said he goes to bed at night time dreaming about those pools, and, uh, uh, and I, I could concur with those uh, yeah. comments, you know, 100%. That's great. Thank you. Thank Pleasure, you for that. Pleasure, mate, and it's been lovely to meet you uh, too. You too. Rob, Thank absolutely you. lovely, mate. Good. Good on you. Thanks Thank a lot. Bye-bye.